Well, we're packing up. Just got a short time and we'll have uh, our good oh. friend uh, who takes care of our place all the time. Uh, she'll be here. <laughs> Give me a ride into town. It was after the her visit from Hurricane Nadine. <laughs> All washed. Everything was wet. It rained torrents through the night. Never heard anything so loud ever in the rain. And I've been in some good rains. But it cleaned everything. You gotta get that ladder. You can hear kind of our critters in back doing a jittery jitterbug sounds. Here's where the rain came up over here. It's pretty deep. Hibiscus tree is enormous. Should try to harvest some. It's very big. And it's mixed into another tree. It looks like I have to. See if that's true, or if that's just one tree. Looks like it's one tree. Look how tall the fox tail got. Very tall. I think I've gone through this. Probably grows leaps and bounds every time. Every time it rains like that. You have to hose around the jug. There's a little clue how much water. This basin's a few inches, looks like. And we gotta just count our blessings, be very grateful. We are got a lot of good. And there's the water, how deep it got back here. Pretty deep, and that'll all drain out. I'm gonna clear that, and here's the bath mat I was rinsing off real good. It got rinsed real good with the rain. Now I gotta put it back up so it rinses again and probably rain again. Let them know. The aloe vera's. Got their new home since we've been here. It looks pretty good. Leaving it safe and sound, hopefully. They uh, can have a good stay. Got it ready and have some uh, new, new activity. There's some really pretty flowers. Yeah. Of course, there's a nice one of the palm trees on our side here. Pretty good size. A little vine is crawling up a bit, maybe. Here's a nice little big guy. He was tiny. He was so tiny. Beautiful. This one back here from Sean we put in last year, if you can imagine, that coconut tree was put in last year and it was little, it was over half that size, littler, more little. This guy's been here a while, he's doing real big and you see all the other coconut trees. I think there's one, two, three, four, five, six, and then I think Eric put in three, so we got about nine, nine coconut trees here. There's an uh, avocado. We've got a little pool going on over here right by the electric thing. And the power went off just for a short time uh, yesterday, not even two hours. You can see the fluttering. There's little butterflies, and they're big, some of them. Hanging out. I don't want to get too, too lit up if the bugs are out because it's all wet. But nothing seems to be biting me. Just a fly or... There's this guy, coconut. But that'll be nice if they ever get where we can get coconuts off these, like the neighbors took off. And they were at least that little. There's another one in the water since yesterday when he put it in. I think he put one over here, maybe not. Yep, he's over there. Little coconut tree baby, right there. You can see how wet. Everything got. We we'll get one last walk through since, uh, like I say, we're gonna pack it up. I don't know when we'll get back. But look how wet.
feels so good walking through it. I hate to say it, but it feels really good. You know, I know it's not the best idea, probably. And then I've got my entrance sign. So when you're driving up, hopefully you notice and see it. But we got some yellow flowers here. And right here's the property line. You can kind of see here at the electric box. There we go. See how wet it got. And uh, there's some of the yellow flowers. Already, you know, fun. It's been fun. It's been a lot to get done, and we still have a lot we we'll want to do. And back in the back, there was that one, one or two moringas on the one side. And I thought we ended up with just the one made it over here. I think he's putting more seeds in. I'm not sure what will will happen. The vines are down here. Here's our little and then people There's a back black bag. I want to pick it up that rain threw it over there. You can see there's a moringa. Two banana. And one banana tree and one other coconut tree. There's a banana in the back over here. So we have two, two that may may do something. That vine is a cactus vine. It's gorgeous. A lot of oxygen. You know, breathing in a lot of oxygen because palm trees put out more oxygen than any any of the other trees. I don't know what it is about them. Some studies they've done. So we. Uh, had a great, great visit.